This is Openly Hostile Opinions. With your host, Casey and Jay. What the hell is wrong with you? I can do anything I want to do, but anytime I want to. Now we're looking for evil guys. 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 Now we're looking for evil
uh, they took pictures from the Creed movie where he was dying, <laughs> and they posted it, and they're like, Sylvester Stallone died, he was hiding, he had cancer, and all this shit. I'm like, at least come up with something good. You came up with the photos from the fucking Creed movie where he was dying in it. Ugh. Megan wants to know if we all cut our hair. Uh, Greg didn't shave. Right, Greg I doesn't have hair. I, I shaved my facial hair. He a really bit. looks like James now. Don't look at him. Yeah, <laughs> I know he does. He always does, man. He look. He looks like a fat James Hetfield. Yeah, he looks like James Hetfield if he swallowed a whole turkey. <laughs> fat short James the fuck Hetfield. Was that, noise? that was my phone. He forgot Stupid to turn it off because because he's, he's a bad God entertainer. Damn it. Yeah, I, I just got my hair cut today. Actually, I couldn't take it anymore. I look like a fucking. You're going beetle. bald. Oh, I've been going bald, man. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking You were already did. bald. Yeah, I know. How fucking about it? I don't know. Whatever. I did want to mention something, though, quick. Uh, I mentioned this last week. Um, my two cousins are uh, doing their own podcast called Shrek Talk. Uh, I mentioned this last time. And so you you need to spell that, too, because I was thinking Shrek like Shrek and Donkey. Sort of, yeah. That's how it's spelled. Like it, no, guy. it's not. Yeah, it's it is. S-C-H-R-E-K or something. It's Shrek S-H-R-E-K. Uh, I don't think so because they followed us on Twitter and I followed them back. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, so yeah. Um, Try to keep up, Casey. Yeah. Go it's fuck your own yourself. cousin. Go do heroin. <laughs> okay. I don't like heroin. Uh, yeah, Megan. They're your pubes. Actually, I shaved them while you were sleeping and I put them on my chin, so I can smell you all day. I think she's talking about my my little chin puff here. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, I think so. Uh, but anyways, like I said uh, last week, um, they do a lot of stuff like music, uh, videos movies everything like that so if you're interested after the show here i'm gonna post them all over our twatter and facebook so go ahead and check them out it's called shrek talk which you said you were gonna do last week and didn't yeah but i just i wanted to make sure (laughs) that you know i wasn't bullshitting around yeah she was talking about jay yeah fuck is wrong with so like i said if you're if you're interested in that casey um, broke it yeah i broke the chair sorry i get really when i play wow i get like really involved Smash your keyboard Smash and shit. Smash my fucking keyboard. Ask for a heel again. <laughs> <laughs> Missy's here. Hello, Missy. No, I play a mage now. Oh my I God. stopped healing. Because they made healing so hard, no one understands it. So I was getting sick of explaining healing to people. <laughs> They'd be like, I didn't get a heal in point zero five five seconds. I'm like, go fucking jump off a building and kill yourself. <laughs> I was sick of explaining and, it. And then wait for somebody to not heal you then. <laughs> exactly. Oh, man. Uh, at least you're... Um, chairs didn't get stolen off yeah i, I want to talk about this because this is really embarrassing to megan but um i don't care <laughs> megan lives in the ghetto though but it, it's megan's fault here's the thing so uh megan was cleaning out her house today sorry megan uh <laughs> she took everything that she uh didn't want anymore she put it on the porch okay a bunch of totes all things you know glorious and everything like that and uh she called the salvation army so the salvation. <laughs> so she I goes. See where this is going. So she goes. You know, just pick up the stuff. It's on my porch. Blah blah blah. So she forgot to tell him. Don't take everything. Like you know, her son's bike, uh, his other toys, and everything. So they came and just took everything off her porch. Well, what the hell would you think they would do? <laughs> exactly. Exactly. That's why. We say when she does stuff, it's called mega stated because it's just it's her. It's her. Oh Jesus, Megan. <laughs> so so that sucks. Sorry, Megan, to embarrass you, but uh, I was planning on talking about that anyways because it's too good not to share. <laughs> I told them it was just one tote, dude. They don't tell the driver shit. You yeah. just put that stuff in the house. Yeah, you put a sign up that says just this stuff. And then you move the other stuff like a like move it like a cow move or you know fucking put it away yeah. or in the house. She also fell and hurt herself today. Uh, did she do it? Besides, because I remember she texted me and said that she almost fell in a mud puddle. Did she almost fall again? Because uh, she said her thighs hurt. Hazy uh, seventy eight joined. Hello, Hazy. Hello, Hazy. Hope you're feeling not too hazy today. Um, oh, that was lame. I know. <laughs> Where is it at? <laughs> I was like, there's something wrong with this thing. No, you can turn it. The volume's probably low. You probably turn the volume. Oh. Yeah, no, we, we were screwing around with the... Uh... Stop touching shit, all right? I didn't do it. You did it. Yeah, we got... Well, what's that fucking thing called? No, we, we have I a digital know. interface. Yeah, we got a digital interface. Um, it's, it's over there. It's prettier than my face, so I didn't want to use it yet. Uh, it's over there because Greg came in early, tried to set it up. Found out we it need, worked. Yeah, it worked. It's just we need more time to do download stuff and all this. We, we do everything at the last minute, if you guys haven't noticed. Yeah, we do. <laughs> we gotta, I got to set up that VPN and uh, download some things. 
download some legal stuff Le- less than legal speaking we- of vpn sign up <laughs> sign up for private internet access it's not halfway through the show yet <laughs> oh, oh, oh net dot pw slash oh, oh, vpn uh, we'll, remind- we'll do a regular plug later but hey yeah, yeah that's good it's a good segue that reminds me though i haven't seen mama bear in the chat in a while i wonder what she's been up to probably found something to do with herself <laughs> yeah, that doesn't I know. involve listening to two idiots talk i remember that one time she goes uh yeah, so uh, I come here to hear what the outside world is. I'm like, you come to us for that? Jesus yeah, Christ. Yeah, you have you have sadly yeah, sadly decided to and, do uh, something. And what's his name that always came that didn't fuck his wife anymore? What was his name? Oh, yeah, he still comes in. Yeah, I haven't seen him. I feel like I haven't ass. seen him in a while, though. Yeah, he, I wonder if he fucked his wife yet. I'm sure he didn't because he's like a piece of shit. <laughs> what do you want to show us, Greg? I forget. Yeah. <laughs> you forget. Greg has a story for us. What, what was it? The clit, clit liquor? liquor? 3,000. <laughs> the clit liquor. Is I, wish, I, I, wish like, we I could, guess. I, I wish we could show you a picture, but let's try to describe it. <laughs> what? Fuck. I closed it. Well, you idiot. Why would you <laughs> Here, go ahead. Okay. Try try to describe that thing. Uh, That's what it looks... Can you see that? <laughs> Probably not. It's called the Clit Liquor 3000? Yeah. It's a, it's a woman's sex toy, apparently. Right. Uh, it looks like a mouth with a fucking Fellas, tongue. we done. R.I.P. 2018. The Clit Liquor 3000 is shutting shit down. Ain't no sex doll. B.I.H. Whatever the fuck that means. Hashtag head game changer. Hashtag no home is safe. <laughs> no, no home is safe. <laughs> What's it going to break in and steal your laundry? Like No, it's going to steal your woman. The clit it, liquor. He's saying they don't need us for nothing no more. And the guy that posted said, Game Changer, we fucked, guys. <laughs> I guess there's a little video of it here? Yeah. Oh, this is a guy just re- I don't think... I thought he had... Yeah, they show a that. video of it. Oh, really? It, Not, it, it wags. Yeah. It wags. Jesus Christ. If you want something to wag, just get a dog and fuck that. Jesus. I think that's crossing some lines. I don't know. Uh, there's a book I read. It wasn't really a book. It was more of an article. And it said... Uh, Pretty much, if any woman owns a big dog, they're fucking it. Uh, what? Yeah. <laughs> and it's pretty funny now, because now every time I see a story where a girl got caught fucking her dog or something like that, I just like, hmm, <laughs> I wonder if it's more true than I thought. Like, there was one where some girl was actually accidentally live streaming fucking her dog. Uh, that was nice. Um, <laughs> I, just, uh, I wonder what PETA has to say about this. Oh, probably nothing, because, you know, they don't want to... PETA seems like one of those people that are, like, feminist. <laughs> so if a guy was doing it, it's no, bad. No, they're animalists. Yeah, whatever. Feminists. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, so I guess we're done. I don't know. We're I, done? Okay, see ya. The, the, <laughs> Go home and take a there's, nap. There's no <laughs> way. Fucking tired. There's no way the Clit Liquor 3000 will uh, take it's... over the human man's mouth, though, because there's no moisture. And there's no like that's what lube's for. I know, but you can't, you can't, you can't get past the body. It's just not the same. Yeah, you can't get pi- past, past. I'm a, I'm a, I have some experience in this. this <laughs> I'm a Southern Baptist for some reason, but you can't get past the 98.9 degrees. You mean you mean you've had somebody <laughs> lick your clit? No, no, I just mean I'm very experienced in this matter. I'm going to need three of those. But ba- what your <laughs> what your fucking clit that big, Megan? Jesus, God damn. <laughs> Megan's over here talking about her wizard sleeve. Jesus. <laughs> wizard sleeve. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Sorry, what the fuck's man. wrong with you? I don't know. <laughs> That's what vaginas look like, man. Fucking. Uh, apparently, t- you and I have been looking at different vaginas. The whole time I was watching Harry Potter, he's sitting there swinging his wand with his fucking sleeve on him, just thinking of vaginas the whole time. <laughs> I was like, God, man, this fucking movie's in their sexual endowendos. <laughs> you were probably one of them waiting there like, man. <laughs> Hermione's gonna be legal soon. Oh yeah, her eye, uh, her mine ass. <laughs> I had naked pictures of her really? on my computer. Yeah. Oh, that surprises me. <laughs> I don't think they're real. Oh, but probably not. It doesn't matter. Actually, I did want to bring this up. That reminds me. So I guess there's this new technology now, and it's all over Reddit. Um, of course it is. Yeah. Uh, when you when you spoke of that, because there was a video of what's her name, the actress's name that plays Hermione. I don't know. Emma Watson. Emma Watson. Oh, that's right. Um. This new program is so good, it's pissing people off. What it does is it takes any porn video and it replaces their face with any movie star that you want. And it's, like, really, really good. And you could barely tell. Every once in a while, it sort of, like, glitches and you can, like, see that it's fake. But it is so real, it's, like, pissing everyone off. But they're getting around it because instead of talking about it and, like, selling the porn as porn... They're more talking about the program and what it's doing. 
so they're not getting in trouble for it because it's a technology post. So <laughs> we could use this technology to graft Greg's head onto a gay porn star or something? Yes. That'd be fun. Yes. It's one guy, I think, that has it, so I don't know how to get a hold of it. Can we bit torn it? <laughs> Can we make sure you use it. a VPN first. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, oh net.pw <laughs> slash oh, oh, VPN. Ten minutes, Jay. <laughs> Probably shouldn't advertise this for illegal means. <laughs> I don't think they give a crap. Oh, okay. That's probably why they were created. <laughs> no, like, but... That's like I said, that's why Snapchat was created. A guy was getting sick of getting caught with other girls' <laughs> nudes on his phone. What's going on with that? What? Do you use Snapchat at all? I don't you know. even know what Snapchat is. It's, it's I like, have it in the past. So you remember, I don't know if Facebook still does this. The Messenger, you could like make the messages disappear. Uh-huh. There's like a fucking secret mode or oh, something. Oh, I didn't shit. know that, no. Snapchat, I think it went away. Snapchat is where it's a program, and when you someone sends you a picture, you only can view it for a certain amount of time. And yeah. when it first came out, it was just a very basic program, and uh, people were just using it to send nudes. Because, you know, once the 15 seconds was up, you didn't have it anymore. Because people were whores? Yeah, so you couldn't show it to anyone anymore. And uh, now it's That's what screenshotting's for. Yeah, exactly. Um, but now I guess there's this huge update, and no one likes Snapchat, and everyone's, like, freaking the fuck out. I'm like, the things to freak out about. Fuck. Go get a job. Go join a monastery or something. <laughs> Doesn't believe. Snapchat have, like, weird filters or something? Yeah, that's where you see all the fucking people putting <coughs> bread on their head and shit. You know what I mean? Like, they have a piece of toast on their face. I and... thought that was the mental hospital. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I can't believe you don't know what Snapchat is. I don't know. Hey? Like, you don't, don't know? What... No, Jay. Well, I've never really used it. What the fuck is wrong with he you? He has kids. <laughs> I... I have kids. Uh, do you? <laughs> <laughs> Damn, dude. It's cold. Cold-blooded. No, nah, I like... <laughs> oh, wait. I get it now. <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> yeah, see, there you go. you're getting pretty good at that. I, I like him on the sound effect board. That's why I gave it to him. Gives him something to do. Yeah, exactly. With all the caffeine and nicotine he's on. Top <laughs> on. Um, I did have a couple stories though today. Uh, this one I wanted to cover because it just shows the true American way of. You talking about the f- school shooting in Florida? <laughs> oh, <laughs> whoa, whoa! That, that, that seems was, to be the American that was way. Dark, dude. <laughs> Holy See, shit. That seems to be the American way. <laughs> oh, my God. Now nobody's going to watch. Oh, I actually saw Thanks. A, I actually saw a funny meme. It was a guy hitting on a girl, and he goes, are you a school? And she goes, no, why? And he's like, I just want to shoot kids all over your face. I'm just like, God Oh, damn. man. <laughs> yeah. Uh, probably going to get banned for that. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Whatever. Didn't this just happen a week ago? Right. Oh, there was another one, too, because uh, I guess it happened on Valentine's Day. And uh, someone yeah, was like, "Yeah, that's what I'm talking about." Yeah, and someone said that his favorite band was Bullet for My Valentine, dude. Yeah. Uh oh. OBS Studio disconnected. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh man, hopefully we're up again. <laughs> <laughs> this fucking shit. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, it was just like nope yo see what happens when you talk about school shooting <laughs> dude, that's probably what was going on I, gar- I guarantee it dude shit what is going on man I don't know if we're back up or running or not no it's frozen refresh it though refresh no, it. It I think like we might be back up are we because it says OBS doesn't no, look, work it just froze. Nah, it just froze again it says OBS is not working at all <laughs> okay <laughs> Jay, why do you have to bring up school shooting? I got, Good fucking job. I got carried away with it. Uh, oh, man. Hold on a second. Let me see here. Try, yeah, it's not there. The show's down. Oh, Did your internet just die? No. Did you pay the fucking bill? Yeah, I paid it today. <laughs> like, literally, I just paid it today. Hundred fucking sixty dollars. Uh, there's a big red light on it. I know. That's, 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 that's probably not good. That's why I think it's not working. Oh, goody. I don't. Should yeah, I, it's froze up. Should I restart OBS? <laughs> Let's refresh this page. At least we're recording still. <coughs> Are we? Yeah, we're recording. You can still stitch together and put it on the YouTube. It was a guy hitting on a girl, and he goes, "Are you a school?" And she goes, "No, why?" <laughs> See, and right, right there, that you finished right, the joke. Right there is where they're like, "Okay, these people are." Uh, <laughs> they shut us down. <laughs> All right, I'm restarting. Fucking NASA. OBS. Hey guys. Hey, we're back. It's Are moving. We? Are we? Yeah. Okay. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah, sorry everybody. We See uh, what happens when you talk about fucking shooting kids. Yeah, I guess uh us talking about school shootings, uh <laughs> They pulled the plug. <laughs> they pulled the yeah. they pulled oh, the, it's green now. They pulled the plug on us, so sorry about that. <laughs> Oops. Oh shit, my monitor went bad. This fucking computer. What, <laughs> what the hell? What the hell? What the fuck is wrong with you? 
What do you mean your monitor went bad? <laughs> my monitor went bad. I have to like wiggle this around. It's like a connection I can't change. Oh, yep. Man. All right. My computer's fucked. Okay. We're done. Jesus <laughs> Christ, yeah. man. Get the fucking. This shit's Why just falling apart, fucking dude. breaking today? <laughs> we need. Oh, oh we need fucking. Look, I can't even get in chat now. What the fuck? Uh, yeah. Sorry, everybody. Uh, uh, if you're just joining us again. Uh, we were talking about school shootings. Uh, Jay's computer the NSA broke. shut us down. <laughs> the NSA <laughs> shut us down. Uh, yeah. So sorry. <laughs> uh, but what we were talking about <laughs> before. Change the subject. Yeah. Um, why is my thing? Look at it. Why is that? I, what I'm saying. We're, everything's There's breaking. probably a missile incoming right now. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, we are so professional. A accidentally. <laughs> accidentally. I sent. can't even get in the chat. Yeah, there probably is a missile accidentally sent by Twitter because I guess that's how they do it these days. They uh, send missile alerts through Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah. Uh, yeah. There, there's people joining us again. Uh, yeah. Like we yeah, said. My uh, wife came in. She hasn't said anything today. Uh, maybe she's, she's wasted. She's getting drunk. Alone. <laughs> well, that's, this is one of her days. Hey, she's there's like, Bruno. We were just talking about him. Bruno. Hey, what's up, buddy? Go have sex with your wife. Yeah, she we deserves were, a little loving. We were just wondering how you were doing, buddy. See if you fucked your wife yet. What's up, man? How you doing? Uh, yeah, be before we got um, so rudely interrupted. <laughs> so rudely interrupted. Because <laughs> Jay brought up school shootings. Uh, bullet for my Valentine. Uh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> so I wanted to bring this up because this is a true American fashion. Uh, you know, Americans are known for being lazy and all that bullshit. So, uh, I guess a teen Olympian overslept after Netflix binge, and he still won the gold medal. Did you hear about yeah, that? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, Red something or other his name was. he. Uh, Red Gerard. Yeah, that's right. He uh, he slept later. He didn't, like, miss his time, but he slept later than he anticipated. Couldn't find his yes. coat. Had to borrow one from his uh, from his uh, roommate. Yes. And said, uh, holy fuck on TV. Which <laughs> <was> <laughs> Did he really? Yeah. I didn't see that part. Yep, he said, holy fuck on TV. I've never been prouder to be an American. Yeah, he says he's 17 years old. Uh, he won the first gold medal uh, on Sunday. Uh, he said he zonked out before the night watching the Fox show Brooklyn Nine Nine, and uh, overslept twenty minutes past six a.m. alarm. Uh, is Brooklyn Nine O Nine or Nine Nine that good? <laughs> I've never watched it. I've never watched it either. Uh, Red, you had a bed. His roommate and teammate Kyle Mack asked him at the time. Uh, yeah, so that's what America does. We don't even try to be good. We just are. So uh, fuck you, everybody that hates America. Uh, back to back World War champions. <laughs> <laughs> what in the motherfucker do you want, Amanda says? <laughs> yeah, she's wasted. <laughs> Amanda's drunk already. She, uh, see, what's sad is she can do that on a Tuesday without issue because she gets no hangovers. Oh, really? Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I hate people that don't get hangovers. I know, like, it's disgusting. What, she can... what fucking, like, child molestation planet where are you from she 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 got so wasted recently that like she had like the tiniest tinge of a hangover uh -huh. and it's like that was it mm -hmm. don't come home you ass i used to <laughs> i used to be like that i used to never get hangovers i'd drink a case of beer and fucking that's be because you were day. never not drunk like, <laughs> you woke um, up and drank more yeah megan's actually like that she could drink a lot just wakes up with a little bit of headache but that's about it but yeah i i loved it i remember when i used to drink I could drink whatever the fuck I wanted and no hangover. Now it's like I fucking see the shit. I go into like a coma. Ugh. If I even sniff a Heineken, I have a headache for like a week. <laughs> that that Vivitrol that you get in your ass, Greg, can you drink on it? I can. I won't get drunk, though. Why won't you get drunk? Well, you, the, I, apparently it doesn't work as well for alcohol. I've heard people still drink and like get fucked up. Oh, really? I don't know. I haven't tried it. Because I, I remember you just saying it was for opiates. Hear me, P.O.? I haven't tried it. <laughs> See, they, they say that, from what I understand, is, like, you won't get the effects. Uh, the, the yeah, like, your body part. will still be fucked up. Like, you can't, yeah. you, you fall over on your face. But, yeah. uh, like, you're, in your brain, you won't think you're drunk. We, we should do that in the show sometime. Take some shots of Vivitrol, just get drunk. <laughs> see, what it, <laughs> see what it does, though. I, I'm pretty sure Greg will end up in prison for that. Yeah, he's already been there. He knows what it's like. He show us the ropes. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty, yeah, right. Just don't give us hepatitis. Pr pretty sure my PO is not watching this shit show. You should tell him about it. No, I'm not going to. <laughs> ever. Is your PO a girl or guy? Guy. Not really. Yeah, he's, he's all right. I was hoping it'd be a girl. Maybe he can, I don't know, some porn start like that. <laughs> Why? I don't know, man. What? You watch weird movies, don't you? Ah, oh, whatever, man. Porn. Porn's great. It's a great backbone of American society. No, oh, all right now, man. Amanda's trying to get people to get, get drunk and shit with her. You she's know, on she's on shot enough. number five. 
Yeah. Uh, she's come a long way. I remember she used to have one drink and she'd be like, hee <laughs> <laughs> Now she's a full-blown raging alcoholic. <laughs> Damn. She learned from you. Yeah, that's all right. I, I was an alcoholic. I'll admit it, man. I, uh, You're the only alcoholic <laughs> I've ever known. It's just like, yeah, I'm done. Uh, yeah, I uh, and that's why I think I... I, I'm pretty sure I was talking to someone about this the other day. I think I drank so much alcohol, uh, my body was like, "No more." Uh, you are now allergic to alcohol <laughs> because when I drink alcohol, I get so fucking sick. Like I'm not talking about the next day, like a hangover. I'm talking about when I drink it. I get well, yeah, shaky. Me too. Yeah, like I get shaky. Oh, uh, no, I get really different. bad anxiety. Um, I just it fucking sucks, dude. And I think my body's like no more, dude. You drank yourself to retardation and just no more. Because like I said, I used to drink a I, lot. I, yeah, <laughs> I used to spend a hundred dollars at the bar, go home and drink a case of beer till in the morning, and then go to work. <coughs> I, I was, was there a, a couple of them nights. Yeah, I was a functioning alcoholic, if that's what you want to call Fast it. Fast Times says, why don't you guys get a spray tan like Trump? Might improve ratings. <laughs> we have would ratings. I get, would I get the cool, cool like? Like white eye circles, though? Yeah, I know. That's the thing. We, you know, Trump, if he would get a spray tan, I bet you there's, like, he's so rich, I bet you there's, like, crystals of diamonds in it and shit. We can't afford that shit. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to know what the fuck his hair's made out of. I don't know. There was there was uh, just a clip of uh, him walking up the steps into Air Force One, I guess, and this wind oh, yeah. was blowing, and people were like, what the? It's like, why are you surprised by this? We know it's fake. <laughs> just like his wife's titty. You know probably. what? I don't even know that it's fake. I I'm going to, like... I'm gonna go out on a limb here. I think his hair is real. He just I just think it, like it. it well, yeah. I think it's you know it, it used to be that kind of golden straw color, but mm. I think with the whole you know I'm president thing, he oh, doesn't yeah. have time to keep up on the dye job. Oh yeah. So I think it's snow white and gray mm -hmm. underneath, like root wise. So yeah. when when the wind blew, uh huh, it looked like there was like bald head, but I think it was just his roots. Oh okay. Yeah, because uh, I, like I said, like I don't like. I don't know. I don't know why people are making such a big deal about it. Because I was like, we know that he has really fucked up hair. <laughs> why are we surprised about it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like Fast Times says, real and died. That's exactly it. I think that's what it is. He, you know, he dyes his hair because he's a 70-year-old man. So, of course, he fucking does. Uh, you just have to push past feeling and you'll be golden pony boy. What? <laughs> You're, like, way the hell behind on the chat. I there. know. I Jesus told you. Christ. It's fucking... That actually reminds me. Uh... <laughs> We don't really talk about politics on the show because it makes us want to cut our dick off. But I guess, uh, did you see uh, they released the uh, painting of Obama? Mm, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> so people were like, oh, you know, that's really nice. And some people really liked it. So they Googled the woman that does the paintings. Mm -hmm. um, that's not usually what she paints. She usually paints black women decapitating white women's heads. <laughs> like... It's it's rude. that that stinks of fakeness to me. Oh no, it's real because I looked into it. <laughs> like I was like, this can't be real. So I'm like googling and shit, and I'm like, oh okay. <laughs> I was like, her name. I Why would they commission somebody with that to, to do a presidential report? That doesn't make sense. I don't think they looked into it. <laughs> I don't think they really looked into it because uh, you know how his painting has the leaves and stuff in the background. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's what she's known for in these other paintings where these women are cutting uh, other women's heads off. Uh, they're the leaves in the background stuff. That's like her signature, I don't know, move. I'm talking about a WWE move, I guess. The razor or the pedigree. That was my favorite, Triple H. <laughs> she only paints with vaginal fluids. What the hell's wrong with you, man? <laughs> Hey man, there's some. There's a lot of women that do that. Uh, there's this one girl that makes uh, tampons out of her own uh, vaginal pubes, and she sells them for lots of money because that's what people want, I guess. That doesn't Ugh. sound very absorbent. I know that's what I said. I was like, I don't think pube hairs are very absorbent. Like, I don't know. I could be wrong. Whatever. I don't even think people use them. I think guys buy them and like smell them <laughs> and like. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Greg's going to start buying them and gluing them to the top of his head. <laughs> yeah, where can I get these? <laughs> if I don't get them, there'll be hell to pay. <laughs> hey, it's uh, 8.30, Jay. You can start now. No, it's 8.34. You're late. Four minutes late. This computer's broke. Get a pregnancy test. <laughs> get a VPN. Ohonet.pw slash ohovpn. Oh, that's how you feel about our sponsors. You talk up school shootings, but... You know. <laughs> I'm just saying, you know, like, it's... I, I've been I've been going through the same spiel. All of our viewers know at this point, if you want to, like, stay protected on the internet, you need a VPN. And the way to do that is with private internet access. They are the best. I use them myself. I've used them for years. And if you want to use them, too, and help us out a little bit in the process, get a little kickback money... 
Uh, you can do that through ohonet.pw slash ohovpn. Sign up through that link, and uh, you'll get it for a relatively inexpensive price, and we'll get a couple bucks back. Yes. But none of you have done Money. that yet. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't played that in a while. But none of you have done that yet. Yeah, VPN, Virtual Private Network. You can use it to protect yourself on the internet. Keep your ISP and keep your... Uh, Stop breaking the law, asshole! <laughs> keep, keep the cops out your business. <laughs> Why is it so long? I don't know. All right, continue. I need to stay. My husband doesn't need to stalk me virtually. <laughs> what? Did you, what? This fucking ADHD over here. What the hell is she talking about? I don't know. She's wasted. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. Go home, Jay's wife. You're drunk. She is <laughs> home. So I follow them. Drunk. I follow them. I was uh, right behind them on the way home. Uh, Bruno says, I don't "Have want... you seen the Martian lady talking on scope?" The fuck uh, no, scope? we have not. Uh, no, fill us in on that, Bruno. We have not seen the Martian lady talking on scope. What's and, that all about? In the meantime, uh, Fast Time says, "I do. I don't watch kitty porn. Do I still need a VPN? Uh, VPN yes. just protects you online from prying prying eyes." Uh, also, if this whole fucking bullshit with the whole repeal of net neutrality goes through, if you don't want to like deal with your ISP slowing down traffic and shit, uh, this is a good way to fight back. So that's one of the reasons why we try to pick them up as a uh, as a sponsor. Uh, it, it's uh, definitely something we believe in. We don't believe in censorship of the internet. And uh, using a VPN is about the only way that there's going to be to fight back, honestly. That's so sad, though. Like, it used to be such a big deal if we caught the government spying on us. Now we're just like, yep, they're doing it. It's cool. Whatever. We just we just have to download programs now so they don't. But, you know, whatever. Well, back in the day, we used to be like, man, I don't want the uh, government to wiretap my phone. Now days is like, hey, wiretap, can you please reorder cat food? <laughs> <laughs> I know. I know. And that's the thing. Like, it, it's, it's just so ridiculous. And it just surprises me of how submissive people are how we just don't give a fuck that our government is bending us over and fucking us in our ass i mean how many people are putting these things in their house hey wiretap what are the movie movie choices today <laughs> yeah, exactly <laughs> um and that's the thing like i just i don't know i almost bought this shirt one time but they were out of them and it said i don't have sex the government fucks me every day uh i wish i had that shirt they were sold out though so pissed uh it's just people don't care anymore i guess saw a picture where somebody t took their iphone and their uh and their webcam on their laptop and faced them towards each other. It's like, I made my FBI agents go out on a date. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I was reading about that because some uh, lady was talking about it. She's like, so does everyone get their own FBI agent? Or, like, do, you know, one household get assigned an FBI agent? And, like, who watches the FBI agent? Is there an endless cycle of FBI agents yeah. watching other FBI agents? And she was like, can I get, like, a profile on my FBI agent? Like, is he cute? Can I ask him out to dinner? It was pretty funny, actually. But uh, that's what that's... I think it'd be more of an NSA agent than an ah, FBI yeah, agent. Probably. Either no, they're not spying on us. <laughs> I wonder. I wonder if they ever get lonely if I don't log on for a while. I know some of them are saying that too. They're like, I wonder if like an FBI agent, if he's assigned to me, if he gets like really sad that I didn't get on the internet that day. Like you know, his wife and him were fighting. He you know can't get a boner because he's old and he can't drive the porn. And the one thing he was looking forward to was seeing me that day. He didn't get to see me. <laughs> My my wife says it, it, that there's one per two mile radius. That seems oddly sp specific. I think she knows shit that I don't know. <laughs> my wife has a double double life as a government operative. That, that seems extreme, dude. It's every two mile. Like that's a lot of fucking agents, dude. I, and Amanda says it cycles every five years. Wow. Uh, yeah, she she definitely seems to have some insider knowledge here. <laughs> your, your, your wife like has all this shit written down on a fucking post it note. She's like, I knew this conversation would come up. <laughs> that, yeah, that is. I think your uh, wife is uh, a little crazy. Yeah, Bruno says that, uh, that. Well, damn, the chat went way too fast. This sucks. Hang on. Um, right. I can read it. Uh, the Martian lady says, she says the aliens are mad at our government and it's coming to end us. Martians are good aliens, evil. What? I don't. Martian, what? They, what? Martians are Martians good. are good, but the other aliens are evil. Is yeah. that? I don't know. I mean, are we talking about, like, Mexicans? I'm hoping for it, because I don't think people on this planet deserve to live. <laughs> everyone everyone is so fucking selfish and ungrateful, people need a wake-up call. So if aliens are coming, I fucking welcome it. Maybe I can live my live-long dream of being a mercenary then and just be ruthless, not have anyone close to me, and I just kill aliens for money. 
ever consider going hard hard conservative to get more ratings it works absolutely not why, i don't think we have what who we don't we, so, we, we don't take, we don't take a political Where, stance where's this hat <laughs> i don't know dude this guy's uh thinking fast times well <laughs> I, I mean we don't fucking take much of a political stance in general because it's not what we're about we we just try to be funny yeah it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't really work but uh we try <laughs> actually really we just tried to start talking about bullshit and then everybody started finding us funny so we just go for it yeah uh martians are different than aliens please explain that uh i never knew that yeah um, aliens are the ones that hang out in front of the home depot asking you to <laughs> take them home and- god you, just, he <laughs> you, you remember what happened like 20 racist. minutes ago we got <laughs> shut down <laughs> what is going on here? did you get laid lately or what's going on man i get laid all the time <laughs> you're just so aggressive <laughs> or maybe it's because I'm just it's, fucked it's, up on meds and I'm like thinking you're aggressive. Because <laughs> I'm all like, like can, I, can they, I have some? Yeah, sure. Sweet. <laughs> Me crazy, but you're talking about aliens. Uh, and it's Will Butrin. That's what they think is oh, making no, all these people shoot shit. up schools. So. Yeah, yeah, that shit's crazy. <laughs> I know it is. <laughs> when the drug addict says, nah, I ain't touching that shit. Nah, do you ever snort that shit? It burns oh, yeah. so bad. Oh, yeah. When it what first came out, I was 16. So I was 16. Uh, it first came out, they subscribed it to me. They're like, here's a new experimental drug. I'm like, okay, just pop it. Uh, and then I remember we skipped school one day, stole a bunch of liquor from these river lots, and uh, we went to my house, slammed liquor, and I sorted a bunch of Wilbutrin, and I got really sick and puked all over my house. <laughs> That's not where some I thought that shit. story was going to uh, go. Yeah, it was, it was fucking god-awful. Uh, Greg wants some crack. He already, yes. has a, he, already has a, he already has a butt. Amanda says she's aggressive. I, I can vouch for that. That's, that's true. Uh, and they are walking among us. Bruno says uh, Martians... According to her, wait, he didn't. You gotta explain what Martians are, though. How are huh? Martians different than aliens? Besides, uh, they're from Mars. Yeah, <laughs> the whole fuck. They're not from Mexico. Yeah, except from being at um, Home Depot, we have some. God damn it, Chelsea. Yes, where, you do, know, they, <laughs> where do they live again? Uh, close, close to where I work, I think. I don't know where. Shop I'll Vac stop is. on. I'll stop on the way. Shop back. Yeah, sort of. They live. At, they live at Kosovo. What? They live in Kosovo. Megan like and Russia Chelsea, stop getting the fucking ex-crackhead here to try to do crack, you fucking pushers. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <clears throat> Text me. I don't, I don't really like crack. It's more like the, the powder form. The powder form. It's so much better. Oh, yeah. Cracks taste like shit. It does, right? It <laughs> yeah. smells so Oh, bad. yeah. It's fucking god-awful. I've never done crack. But, uh. <laughs> yeah, right. It, it smells god-fucking-awful. Uh, actually. I don't even like taking aspirin unless I have to. Really? I d- I'm not a drug guy. Like I, I hate, I hate opioid pain medicine. I don't. I'm the kind of guy I don't like to be uh, uh, not in control of my faculties. I used to say that same exact thing. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> now look at you. You always like smoked weed and shit though. Back in the day, that's not like it was anything new. No. Yeah. Like I don't even like that. So you. So so I would like to see Jay on Percocet then. If he hates that would it, be open. interesting. Oh, that'd be amazing. <laughs> oh my God. I, I am the most boring. <laughs> oh no, you'd no, be, you would like, be. Ugh. I've had Percocets Ugh. before. I'll get you some really good Percocets. <laughs> like, no. Like you'll be like, like get him a speed like, ball. Yeah. I'm like I just want to eat my blood. It feels like cotton candy. I've, <laughs> I've taken Percocet before. Do you know what I do? I fall asleep. I'm the most boring person in the world when it comes to drugs or alcohol. That you haven't tried Coke then. Uh, I would like to occasionally sleep. <laughs> Can you picture Jay's little short ass running around the coach? <laughs> Jesus Christ. He'd be like fucking going. <laughs> yeah, he'd be like, like Mario. Yeah, he'd be like jumping through my great systems and shit like that, poking his head out my walls and shit like that. Fucking tossing Mario coins that he found somehow. <laughs> <laughs> peeking out there, he'd be the actual guy peeking out the fucking window, yeah. looking for the fucking FBI. It's me, Mario. They're coming to get me. Yes, uh, Jay, have you taken? No, Coke. You can't, it's boring. You what? Can't give Jay a fucking thirty. He'd I'm fucking not gonna die. Fuck Actually, four. <laughs> give him. Here's four the deal. I'm the not fuck? going to. We should, dude. <laughs> Next, next show here. This is aspirin. We, uh, next show, we're all gonna take. Well, Greg can't because he'll die. <laughs> yeah, it won't do shit to me. Yeah. Also, it won't really kill you. It just it won't do anything. And no, I just if I if I take too many of them, it will fucking kill me, no, just yeah. like anybody else. But yeah, the the difference is it if I overdose, fun. I can't be brought back by Narcan. Because it also blocks Narcan. Oh, shit. That sucks. So, so if I overdose, I'm dead. <laughs> Fuck. Damn. I'd be, like, fucking throwing you in the tub right, to fill ice and shit. Yeah, you would have to because Narcan won't nah. work. Damn, that sucks, dude. I didn't know that. Yeah. Who was paying for these? $35. I'm I coming. thought Megan was. 
Yeah, Megan has no money. She broke. <laughs> That's why she lives in the ghetto. Yeah. Gets her gets her lawn furniture stolen. In the ghetto? Yeah, by fucking Salvation Army. <laughs> <laughs> you know you live in the ghetto when your shit gets stolen by the Salvation fucking Army. <laughs> that was her own dumbass fault. Oh, I know. She's a... I call her a walking disaster. <laughs> I call her that all the time. Because every day she texts me like, I almost fell or, you know, I hit my car off of something today or, or snow ripped the side of my car off and... <laughs> Yeah, that happened one time. Snow somehow ripped the side of her car off. Then she got mad, kicked the snow, and like almost broke her ankle. <laughs> uh, I managed to cut my hand yet yeah, last night through a Kevlar glove. How in the fuck, how the did, fuck you did, did you do that? You do that? Were uh, you at a school? How the fuck did you? <laughs> I don't even know. I was wearing a Kevlar glove, and the next thing I know, I'm bleeding. Well, actually, maybe they're not knife proof. They are just bulletproof. You I, know mean, what I mean, the blades we use are they're like surgical blades. But yeah, okay. I, I I don't know. Why do you guys have Kevlar gloves that shot back? Because we're using, we're, you know what I do? You know what my job is? What? I trim plastic. Oh, That's nice. all I do. Nice. All day long. So you cut up Barbies? <laughs> no, I cut up vacuum cleaner parts. Oh, Jesus. That sucks. They come out of the mold. There's flash on them. I cut the flash off. I put them in a the tote. That's my job. Aren't they really hot when they come out? No. They're not? Some of them are. Well, I mean. You, wait, wait, you'll find out. You worked in a kitchen. Yeah. It's, it's no worse than a hot plate. But that's why you wear a Kevlar glove. No, the Kevlar glove so you don't cut yourself. But you did that anyways. <laughs> Somehow I cut through it. Somehow, some way. How, how long is your shift? Seven hours most oh, days. So you just cut plastic for seven. Fuck, God, oh, dude. It's so, uh, dude. You just space out. I, dude. I don't know. I'd be thinking about shit. I'd be like, you know what it is? I, are, I, are, are, are albino polar bears black? Like, you know I, what it I, is? I, just... I just play. I just play my my tunes, and I just I daydream. Oh, you get to listen to music. Oh yeah. <laughs> I, just, I guess that wouldn't be so. I bad, just then. play my tunes, and I daydream all day. That's all I do. What and do it's, you daydream about? Stupid shit like here. School like, shootings. <laughs> school shootings. Mexicans in front of the Home Depot. Cutting yourself that somehow you did it through a glove that you're not supposed to cut yourself. Yeah, <laughs> I, I do that. I, I think about, out. you know, I think about coming, coming home and porking my wife. And then I realize I can't because she has to go to work. <laughs> like, I get home and she has to go to work. Yeah. So that sucks. Yeah, that sort of sucks. That would. You get to see the kids though now more, don't you? Yeah, actually, that's the best part about the whole thing, because I'm working third shift. I get to see my wife and kids more than I have ever done, which is all I've ever really mm -hmm. wanted to do. Yeah, you know, and I'm home on the weekends, which is nice. So that would be nice. I, I miss having a job where I had the weekends off, but whatever. Well, I mean, like it's a little bit different though. Instead of having like Saturday and Sunday off, I have mm -hmm. Friday night, Friday off, and Saturday off, and then Sunday night I have to go in. Is Saturday night for fighting? For Saturday night's all right for fighting. Okay. Yes. All right, good. <laughs> Had to sneak that in there. Oh, that's right. Your vacuum was on your fucking porch, wasn't it, Megan? <laughs> they stole our vacuum. Yo, we yeah. can get you a discount. <laughs> Actually, Megan, if you want, you can have my vacuum. I don't use it because... Um, I don't clean. <laughs> I have hardwood floors. <laughs> if they really stole your vacuum, you can borrow mine for, like, like maybe forever. <laughs> Wait, maybe not forever because I got it for my birthday, so it was sort of expensive. I got it for my birthday. No, not my vacuum. Oh, okay. I was actually really excited when I got it. You know why? Because that's one of those buttons where when you hit it, the cord sucks in. <laughs> and I was like, it's so fucking simple. Dude, I was all bragging about it. I was like, oh my God. And they're like, my mom's 80 year old fucking uh, Auric has that. And I'm like, can I have this? Can you not just be a fucking. It's, you know, the internet has to fucking destroy everything. I'm like, can I just have this one little thing? I'm not used to having nice things. Let me fucking have it. People are just trying to ruin it fucking asshole the metal bin that goes into my shop vac i use as a trash can why don't you just buy a three dollar uh, trash can <laughs> they're literally like three dollars they're galvanized they'll last forever yeah just uh if you're trying to cut it don't wear uh kevlar gloves <laughs> i'm sorry i don't know how you i do. see look see it jesus Christ. i don't know i get cuts all the time i don't do what he does though so what do you do i set molds so you're doing what goes to him basically. he's a mechanic yeah, basically. basically. Yeah. He, so you're uh, like for you're earlier in the line, and then he's down like later. He's not in the line. No, he's not. No, I I put the machinery together that makes him do his like job. he's literally <laughs> a mechanic. Makes him do his job. He's literally a mechanic. Oh, yeah. Okay. Like uh, they like get I these molds. I have a fucking tool bench. It's fucking cool. <laughs> you should see him, dude. Like you see how dirty his shirt is. Yeah. Oh yeah, this I don't have clean. any more clean clothes. Like this, this is clean. This forever fucking ruined every <laughs> shirt I have. Uh, what do you mean it has sentimental value? Well, go get it a, back. How does a fucking trash sell can have sentimental value? Is your hopes and dreams in it? Like, <laughs> I don't get it. How does it? Good lord. How does a trash can do? I don't. Whatever. I'm not even. I'm not even chasing that rabbit. 
Not well, you know it. where it's at, though. You could go buy it back. Yeah, just go buy it back. <laughs> <laughs> they or probably just, threw it in the trash. Or just steal it. Like, fucking, like, just steal. Because the Salvation Army steals from you. Just fucking do it yourself. Uh, we are running out of time. We got about 10 minutes. But I did have uh, one more thing to uh, cover here. I remember how we were talking about when they found that family and people, uh, what was it, like their 18, 13 kids were locked up in the basement. <laughs> He looks like a young Don Rickles. You do. You really do. <laughs> who the fuck do. is Don Rickles? Are you serious? What? Who's Don Rickles? Who, yeah, who, and who looks like him? Comedian Greg. Why? What? <laughs> Don Rickles? Who the fuck is Don Rickles? Don. Really? Yeah, I have no idea who that is. Old comedian. Well, that's it's why. Not funny. <laughs> <laughs> no, I like that. You keep using the horn. We don't play that. <laughs> I don't think it means what oh, oh, my God. God. What the fuck is He does not look like that. See if you can show the camera to that. What the? F- I don't think Greg looks like that. Maybe a little. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell. I gotta gotta see. Get away from the delay. Yeah, that's. Yeah, hey, it's all. It, it's it's on there. Enough. It's on there. He was a casino. Yeah. I haven't seen that. Fucking yeah, you can movie. see. Oh my god, I haven't seen that movie in forever. <laughs> yeah, you can see it really well, actually. <laughs> no, because you're no, because your phone's a 32 inch TV. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> You got the same head shape, but <laughs> he has a couple more wrinkles than you, I think. <laughs> uh, but like I was saying, we, remember, what was that, like 13, 18 kids they had locked up in their basement or something like that? Uh, too many. Yeah. Well, I guess, I think this happened in Pennsylvania, actually. Mm-hmm. Uh, Dolphin County. Where's that at? Harrisburg. 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 Uh, yeah. So, I was in that jail. Oh, you were? <laughs> that's the I worst fuck, that's the down third there. worst fucking county jail in the in like the world, I think. Jeez. At least the United States. That place was. Is that where you got Hep C? Probably. <laughs> We're pretty sure that was from the needle sharing. Yeah, it was probably from the bitch that had Hep C that I showed a needle with. Jesus Christ. Knowing she had the Hep C. Knowingly, yeah. Um, I give a fuck. So dumbass. Um, this just like they always say about how you know they had kids, they locked them up and stuff like that. But this just shows how actually bad it is. So this couple was doing the same thing to their kids. They were locking up at the basement and everything like that. Mm-hmm. Weren't feeding them. The kids got so hungry, they were eating the paint off the walls. Oh, yeah. I read about that the other day. Like, holy Jesus Christ, fuck, dude. Can you imagine being that fucking hungry? I would have done it even if I wasn't hungry, but... <laughs> you, you know it's fucking... And they're in, in that jail. They're uh-huh. going to get fucked up. Oh, yeah. They'll probably By the cops. Them. Oh, yeah. The cops will probably beat the fuck out the, of them. The cops in that jail will fuck them up. Uh, the children were so hungry, they were peeling paint off the walls to eat. Um, they should get fucked up. Yeah, there was three the, children. The cops are corrupt as fuck in that jail. Good. Uh, uh, there was three total children. Two of them died of starvation within a week. God, that's horrible. Yeah. Um, Why would you have children if you don't well, intend on taking I don't know. care of your children? Yeah. Well, I don't know. God, dude, look. Look at that let's, YouTube let's video. Ask, uh, no, look at that YouTube video. Name. You see the thumbnail on it? You can actually see how much paint they ate off the walls. Oh, Jesus. my God. It's like halfway up the walls. Jesus Christ. That's fucked up, man. They ate a lot of paint. Dolphin County. <laughs> um, they pleaded guilty uh, for aggravated assault, conspiracy, false imprisonment. There's false imprisonment? <laughs> like, oh, yeah, I guess marriage. Uh, <laughs> unlawful restraint and child endangerment. Of course it's a child endangerment. Um, they only got 10 years. I thought you would get a lot more than that. Uh, I thought they were pushing for 20 to 40. Yeah, they're they pushing. They should just be it life, should, considering yeah. the kids died direct result. Yeah. They probably won't make it out of DCP anyway. Oh, no. They'll, they'll get killed. 10 years in state prison. Yeah, they're pushing for 20 to 40 years. That's life to me. I'm if sorry. If they make it to state prison, they'll get protected. But Yeah. They, that, might, that, they, they shouldn't make it out of DCP, though. That, that's ridiculous. And see, and see, this is the thing where, like, he, he, he was caught molesting a girl in 2013. So it's like, you wouldn't watch this guy? Like... Jesus fucking Christ. And this is why, like, I don't... If I ever kid, I have a shotgun in my house. Because <laughs> I will... And, and that's the thing. If I ever saw a pedophile touching my kid, one of my kids, I would not kill him. I would just blow his fucking genitals off. Like, can you imagine getting shot in the dick with a shotgun? Like, that's going to fuck your life up. <laughs> I don't I don't know what I'd do. Uh, are you PA guys, Steelers or Eagles? Uh, Casey's a Cowboys fan. I'm what? Cowboys. What? I'm yeah, a Steelers yeah. fan. Cowboys, motherfucker. They're awesome. What the fuck's wrong with you? <laughs> I, I'm a Steelers fan, but this Super Bowl I had to had to root local. Had to uh, root local. 
Right. I'm a Cowboys fan because I watched my brother when I was younger watch him, so it was like a bonding experience. So it's not that crazy that I like the Cowboys, but I do like the Pittsburgh Penguins also because I'm a I'm a Flyers fan. Yeah, exactly. I'm actually going to go see a Flyers game with Amanda here. In a few I, I weeks. really, so be really cool. am going to try to see a Penguins game soon. I want to so bad. I've always talked about it because I heard even if you don't like hockey, they're amazing. I, I know. Oh yeah, she, hockey games are great. Yeah, your mother loved it, and she doesn't really like sports. She said she had a blast. Cowboys fan equals bad parenting. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Sorry, well, Kathy. Well, I didn't know my dad, so there you go. Um, but like I said, uh, I like the Penguins because I watch my cousins. <laughs> what you drinking, girl? Penguins. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't intended to be funny, but that shit's hilarious. Oh, I didn't. She's see drinking that. liquefied penguins. Jesus Christ, man! What? You're, you're, does your wife like penguins that much? I um, I don't know. If she likes the Penguins, it's better than the Flyers, though. I guess we could go see the Penguins instead. Actually, it reminds me. Uh, I was reading about the first person that was ever diagnosed with bipolar. Mm-hmm. You know how they realized that she had it? Because she likes two different hockey teams? No, because eh, maybe. Uh, she felt bad for the Penguins, took all of her money, flew to Alaska to try to save them all. <laughs> Shot number nine? Are you insane? <laughs> Jay's like... I sound angry, but I'm getting my dick wet because I'm raping you later, so I really Are don't you care. kidding me? I'm probably going to have to go take her to the hospital and get her stomach pumped. <laughs> oh, whatever, dude. I take that in the morning as mouthwash. <laughs> Why is don't that... you guys ever charge this fucking thing? I left it here last week. <laughs> Fuck. I charged it. It's plugged in. How's it it's not? It's plugged in an audio. That's not a fucking charging port. Oh, I thought it was. <laughs> <laughs> you idiot. Shows how much I know. No, I forgot to take it home last week. Uh, no dad equals Cowboys fan. Right, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's that's how it works. Uh, yep, my dad uh, just humped and dumped my wife. My wife. My <laughs> what? Whoa. Mother. Oh, uh, my mother. Two things. You can tell I need a cigarette. I can't speak. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, one more of my, and I'm done. <laughs> She's taking another one. <laughs> yeah, whatever. She can handle her liquor pretty good. Apparently, yeah. she can still type. I couldn't. When I get drunk, I can't fucking type. She's doing it on a, random. She's shit, doing it yeah. on an iPhone. That's even worse. Oh God, Greg, well, come do drugs and play Uno with us. Uh, hold on, I gotta call work first. Actually, you should. We do. We just sit around and just play Uno all night. Oh, let's go. Like, fuck it's it's fun. fun. It is a lot of fun. You guys are fucked tonight. I'm. I ain't going. No, we only do it on like Fridays and Saturdays. This is like Friday. Yeah, do you work Fridays? Wait, no. I have to go get a drug test tomorrow. I can't. Do you work Fridays? So most of the time, yeah. Most of the time, I what do. time? Huh? What time? Uh, ten thirty to fucking six in the morning. Ugh, god damn it! That's sad. Once you get a Friday or Saturday off, let us know. Yeah, Uno, Uno is yeah. the shit. Oh, we play Uno. So we... far, we aren't working Friday this week. I don't know. All right, yeah. Because I always go over to Megan's house. We just play Uno and fucking listen to music and shit. It's fun. I actually got drugs. my yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> I got my kid Uno for uh for uh her birthday. Oh, really? Does she like it? Uh, she hasn't played it yet, but I, I think love she it, will. Dude. We get so. heated too. Either though that Megan and Chelsea never know whose turn it is, and I always have to tell them. Like every five seconds, that's sort of annoying, but uh, it's a lot of fun. <laughs> Fast Times really wants us to take a political side. We we don't care, dude. <laughs> we don't care. It's like you that's know, we, we really say, don't like, even don't care. Really you want to know? You want to know my political side? Here's my political side. Political sides is what's ruining this country because exactly. every four to eight years, you have half the country upset. It's like a Coke or Pepsi, PlayStation or Xbox. They're all in it together. It's like wrestling. They pretend they hate each other. They're all jerking off each other in the back. It just it's a it's a huge, huge misconception that we have a choice, but it doesn't matter because whoever we pick is gonna fuck us in our ass anyways, because you have rich people telling poor people what to do, and that never works out. So there's our political side. Exactly. And I'm just sitting here watching it all burn. Because the funny thing is, is people think that we're have a say in this country and we really don't, and I'm just laughing laughing at people getting mad about it <laughs> because i think people are starting to realize they don't have a fucking word to say in this goddamn place <laughs> he says troll a political side it's funny no nah, we don't want to because you know what it just makes us angry it really yeah, does it just i don't know trolling is like i don't know 2010 we but... <laughs> you know what we don't have a big audience but We've done it just by us being our stupid selves. So yeah, I just politics are stupid to me. Like I said, they it's are. a joke. It's a joke. It is all joke. It's it's a way to get people distracted from what's really going on. Like I like like I was just saying this the other day. Remember when the internet was like you know, uh, oh, like everyone. God got, damn it, Jesus Christ, Jay. <laughs> Jesus. 
like everyone got along on the internet and they were like you know shouting out some no. government bullshit and like you know the government's doing this is bad and like oh you know you know let's go after him and stuff and now it's just like the government's like we gotta do something about this and it's like they just everyone just argues all the time on the internet it's like i we, never remember it being peaceful I, I do i remember being so peaceful man like people were getting along people were like you know i think we went to different websites yeah probably uh, we uh, spent a lot of time in WoW. So. Oh, yeah. yeah. I got a raid tonight. That reminds me. Oh, I'm the last boss. Already like 200 wipes in. <laughs> Jesus. But anyways, uh, yeah, we, we don't really talk political, but uh, that's about it for our show today. Uh, I want to thank uh, VPN for uh, being our VPN. <laughs> we should probably put the VPN Private on internet computer. access. We wouldn't have got shut down. Yeah, we wouldn't have got shut down. Uh, Jay talking about school shootings over here. <laughs> I dig it. Baby Don Rickles in the middle is awesome. <laughs> Everybody loves you and you can like, barely talk. I know. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. yeah. He's like, uh, what's his name? Uh, that one guy. That that guy on uh, Don Rickles? Uh, yeah, the Eric Andre <laughs> show that just sits there and does yeah. really nothing all day. Uh, but anyways. Uh, what's Saturday? They want you oh, to okay. come over, do drugs, and play Uno. All right, I'm there. They're, they're telling an ex-drug addict to do God. No, no, look. See, I get no drug tested deserves- Friday. <laughs> well, tomorrow for my job. And then Friday. And then I'm good. Okay. Yeah. Sounds good for good. a week. <laughs> good for a week. As long as my PO doesn't show up. Huh. I'm good. Yeah. All right. So uh, On that note, we're going to get the hell out of here before y'all get Greg in trouble. Yeah, and uh, like I said, I'm going to be posting uh, about uh, Shrek talk. So uh, look I'll for that. I'll bring the crack. Our, yeah. <laughs> I'll bring the crack. <laughs> uh, see y'all next See ya. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Bye. This has been the Openly Hostile Opinions Podcast. (laughs) We are available on YouTube, Google Play, iTunes, and your favorite podcast app. Be sure to like, subscribe, rate, and comment. If you want to help make all this possible, become a patron at patreon.com slash openly hostile opinions. I don't see you. Good afternoon, good evening, and good night.